You can finally charge your DJI Mavic Air 2 and 2S drone batteries using USB-C. Stay tuned as we find out how. Welcome back. At Tech Autos, we do reviews of the latest tech gadgets and automotive products. If you're new to our channel, consider subscribing. Today we're taking a look at what has become one of our favorite accessories for the DJI Mavic Air 2 and 2S drones. For almost two years, you could only charge the Mavic Air 2 series drones via bulky AC adapters or 12 volt DC car adapters, either from DJI itself or from third parties. What if you wanted to recharge your drone battery on the go? Nowadays, we can charge all sorts of devices using USB-C power delivery, phones, laptops, even toothbrushes, and you can charge them using USB-C PD sources like USB battery packs, tiny gallium nitride wall chargers, or even your phone or laptop itself. Finally, your drone can join the party thanks to a compact charger we bought on Amazon. See the link in the description below. The charger comes in a gray textured zipper case that's actually quite nice. Inside we have mesh pockets on either side. On one side, there's a white USB-C to C cable. On the other, we have our charger itself, which we'll put to the side for the moment. Here's the manual. The charger supports USB-C power delivery, but also various smartphone manufacturers' proprietary charging protocols. We're told the indicator light will be red when the battery is charging, blue when charging is complete, and green when it's in a standby mode. The model number is BNX P11 and the dimensions are 55 by 45 by 15 millimeters. It supports 5, 9, 12, or 20 volt input, and the peak output power is 38 watts, which matches DJI's big brick. To get that peak output, make sure to connect a USB C power source with at least 40 watts of output. Now let's take a look at the unit itself. It's tiny, very light, and quite well designed with curves that give it a DJI like air of sophistication. We see the DJI battery connector and an LED light. The side profile is triangular and on one side we see the USB-C port. At the bottom there are two rubberized friction strips with protective plastic on. Looking closely we see the same model number and specs as we saw in the manual. Now let's test it out. We'll plug in a USB-C charger, this one is a 65 watt TechNet charger we reviewed in an earlier video. The LED turns green. Now we'll attach our Mavic Air 2 battery. The LED turns red so it's begun charging. Using our QA U2 analyzer we verified that it charged at full speed, about 40 watts. On most of these batteries that is enough to get a full charge in about 70 minutes. So this way you can eliminate the big proprietary DJI charging brick and use your existing USB-C chargers. You can even use this tiny 20 watt RAV power charger which works great, just a little slower. One detail we noticed is that unlike what the manual says, the charger requests the USB-C power level of 15 volts in addition to 5, 9, 12, and 20 volts, so it should work even with older Apple 15 volt USB-C chargers. But that got us thinking, would the charger work with plain old USB-A ports? Surprisingly, it charged the drone battery even from a laptop USB-A port. This would probably take forever, but it does work in a pinch. Next we tried the USB-A port on the TechNet charger and we got about 12 watts, which is great for a USB-A port. Another thing you could do with this charger is if you wanted to charge two Mavic Air 2 or 2S batteries simultaneously using the stock DJI brick. That has one battery connector and one USB-A port, and we verified that you can indeed plug the USB-A port into this charger. Finally, we hit the road in our Hyundai Kona electric test car. We had our Watobius 83W USB-C car charger plugged in, see our review of that link below. We attached a USB-C cable to the charger and we were charging our drone battery at full speed while on the move. Normally you need a big separate car adapter from DJI to do that. One thing we found very convenient was that our VCU Tech drone case, which we've also linked below, has a slot on the left that's perfectly sized for this charger, almost like it was meant to go there. So now it lives there. Overall, we love this USB-C charger. It's now our preferred method of charging Mavic Air 2 or 2S batteries. If you enjoyed this video, like, subscribe, and post any comments or questions below.